hard gear, just helmets. And, and it's just is that to protect us. is that normal? What's that? Is that normal if you have a police presence to have on your helmets? Well, we didn't know what to expect this afternoon. We just didn't want to take a chance to the officers get hurt. Okay. Um, so really, we're just here to maintain traffic and to make sure the sidewalks stay open and to make sure that the people who are protesting uh, have space to do what they need to do. Okay. And can you tell me, is that a gas mask bag that you have uh, on your leg? Yes, ma'am. Okay. And you don't consider that riot gear? Well, we do have the gas mask, like I said, in case any of the, the riders, you know, a lot of times when we deploy, we end up having to deal with anarchists and whatnot. Okay. We just don't want anybody spraying us with anything. Or, okay. So, but did you come with tear gas or any any? Uh, well, officers all, always have all that. All of our officers always have pepper spray. The, okay. We deploy all. I mean, 24 hours a day with pepper spray to protect ourselves and others. Okay. And was it expected that the um, the various protest groups were going to cross the bridge or enter Virginia? I don't know that information. To be honest. <laughs> okay. Okay. I just the Metro Police are not similarly equipped and they've been accompanying all of the groups so I was curious why the difference so. yeah, to be honest I'm not sure why that decision was made but it's generally just to protect us okay because obviously we don't have a place to stage our equipment nearby and it's just absolute worst case scenario and people get violent with us that we just protect ourselves that's all okay we're not looking to cause any trouble for anybody else have you had any trouble today absolutely not no. everybody's been great okay good Okay, I think this is my first time in Virginia in months. So, hey, I'm in Virginia. Glad to see you here. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for answering my questions. All right, have a good night.